Yeah, sure. Like, it was last June when right. he, he started his last CFL game, and then mm -hmm. it wasn't until this season that he right. strapped it on again. Right. How do you think he's progressing? Um, You know what? I think he did well in the preseason, but that's exactly what it is, the preseason, right? Uh, the main thing for him now is, is you know, I'm really trying to get him to focus on cutting back on the turnovers. He's, you know, a super smart guy. I think at times that – you know, he can overthink things at times just because he's so smart and he knows where the defense should be. But I'm just trying to get him to trust and see what he does with his eyes. So just, you need him to relax? Yeah. No, long story short, he needs to relax and just play ball and play what he sees. Okay. Well, that's not always an easy thing to do because, mm -hmm. you know, he's charged up about the game. Uh, there's Correct. a lot of things happening simultaneously. Mm -hmm. You played the position. Mm -hmm. What kind of advice do you give him? Well, just don't put pressure on yourself. Don't feel like he has to go out and win it all. We've got a lot of great weapons around him, a lot of great receivers, guys that are protecting for him. Uh, we've got hot routes built in. So, you know, don't feel like you have to go out and just win the game yourself. Just go out and manage it. You know what I mean? Go get the ball to the right people uh, and let them catch the ball and get upfield and make plays. And uh, when we can get it to Wilder, we need to do that more as well, too. Ricky Ray got elected to the CFL Hall of Fame today. You mm -hmm. watched him play. Um, mm -hmm. How Played do you with analyze him. him as a person and as a player? Great, great person, great dude. Uh, you know, somebody you, you'd want you want to be out, be around as a friend and as a player. Great mentor. Um, you know, just the way he played the game, the way he prepared on a daily basis. Uh, you know, had the opportunity to back him up in 2012 when we were able to go win the Grey Cup, and uh, you know, it was an honor and a privilege and something I'll never be, never forget. So, uh, definitely excited for him to be uh, nominated. Thank you. Yeah, Appreciate no problem. It.